you have an intimate relationship with him? Like sexual? Yeah, yeah. Did you have, <laughs> did you, Megan, <laughs> did you have a sexual relationship with Tory Lanez? Yes, that's my question. Um, I didn't have a sexual relationship with Tory. What did he say? I didn't have a sexual relationship with Tory. Right. Why do you think he's putting out the story that the two of you had a relationship and that you're making the whole thing up? I think that he is trying to deflect from the fact that he c committed a crime. Stop the cap. See, it's okay for a woman to learn. Oh, you're a victim. Mm. Here we go, CSI. Ooh. It's a sign it will never turn their backs on women. What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to another one. Hit that like on your way in. Tickle that notification bell. That will let you know whenever I upload content, you know what we're gonna do. Yep. Roll that clown. A few moments later. Yes, bitch, I lied to Gil King, bitch. First of all, I didn't know that bitch was even gonna ask me about that shit, bitch. I was always gonna talk about the shooting. Why did you ask me about fucking Tory? I told you. I told you. I told you. You ain't tell me shit. That's not what this is about. Even if I was, I fucked this shit once. Maybe twice on a drunk night, but you kept catching me. I'm, I'm gonna apologize to Megan and Stein. Mm -hmm. I, um, I said some things, because, but and it was because on social media I posted things that when she said uh, she was with Gail and she said that uh, she said, "Were you intimate with Tory Lanez?" And she said, uh, "What?" And then it was like, "No." And I was like, "Ah, she lying." Mm -hmm. At that point, I knew she was. That, She's lying. There wouldn't be no reason for me to be around each other. And Megan Thee Stallion and Tory Lanez, they're currently in uh, trial right now. There's no DNA from Tory Lanez on that magazine. That's lying. I told you. Didn't I tell y'all she was lying? I, I ain't lied to y'all yet. Y'all done had to come back and play flashbacks and shit. Well, I done told y'all that they would go break gun on them. I told y'all. Uh, Megan is known for whooping niggas in bitches when she get drunk. She got kicked out of Kylie party. Come to find out, uh, she done Tory and that other nigga that shot that hoe. That other girl, that other Kelsey, hoe. I told y'all that, man. I told y'all that for all this came out. Uh, man, that DNA evidence is everything. Inconclusive. It's, and this is what the fucker said. He shot six times. If he was the one that shot this gun six times, there's no way DNA yeah. would not be on this motherfucking gun. That's what the motherfucker yeah. said. That's science. See, this is what we've got to discuss. Women lie, men lie. But women lie, nothing happens. He ain't lying. When men lie, their world is over. We live in a society where a woman can falsely accuse a man of essay grape and other things they lose everything yep woman loses nothing we live in a world where me too and feminists have destroyed society now i want you to think how many women have been in trouble and lost it all because they lied don't worry i'll wait <laughs> But women live a free life. And I've always said there's two free people in the world. White men and black women. Because society allows black women to do whatever they want. And white men run the society that allows black women to do whatever they want. So a woman like Meg Thee Stallion can get on national TV and lie on a black man and nothing happens. And we see it time and time again. 
multiple women have lied on men. Women make it a career to lie on men. I'm back with three signs. She lying to you. One, she don't show receipts. One thing about a girl is they're always going to have receipts. If she can't pull receipts up, she lying. Two, she don't get that mad. Like, she calmly telling you, if a girl thinks you lying on her name, she going to get so mad, she going to start screaming at your ass. So if she calm, too calm, baby, she lying. Three, she just drops it. Girls ain't going to drop none. If she dropping it, shawty lying. And shawty lying good because she got show ass done. Because they know there is no consequence. Think about it. What consequence is Meg the Stallion gonna get for lying about sleeping with this with Tory Lanes? None. She can do whatever she wants because she is a black woman. Black women are given free liberty to do whatever they want and they take advantage of it. But let that be. Tory Lanez saying something about Meg the Stallion. Women wouldn't believe him. Women would chastise him. Women would make up all different types of excuses. We see it here. There was a case not too long ago, earlier this week, of a guy being falsely accused of following a woman around the store. I wasn't. Why are you following me? I'm not. I'm looking for money. I just turned on three hours and you still behind me. Can you get you the look. fuck on? And if you look at the video, you see that he's in the lamp section. But because a black woman or a woman decided to say you were following me, all of a sudden, he's getting accused of following her off of her word. Not off of the word of Target, not off of the word of an officer, but solely off of the woman's word. So before you lie about lying, about lying, about lying, about lying. <laughs> you see, women operate in a hive mentality, which means if a woman says that it's true, and even if a woman is caught lying, they don't believe that she lied. They lied and lied. We see it all over the country, all over the world. Fellas, it's time for us to look after each other because women have proven, because women have proven time and time again that they don't have our best interest at heart. They don't care about us. They will throw us under the bus at a moment's notice. Why would you want to align yourself with a group or a demographic of women that will trade you in for the next best thing or lie on you? Yep. Now, all women aren't bad. But enough women are bad. Just like women or feminists love to say, all men till it's no man. Well, I say, all women till it's no women. Anyway, y'all, that's been it for today's video. Don't forget, hit that like, subscribe, tickle that notification bell. That will let you know every time I upload content. And until the next video, peace. Good. Good.